For the 25 plus years that G.I. Joe Real American Hero has been around for, there's been one recurring theme throughout all the different stories that have been told. Each member of G.I. Joe has their own identity. There's Duke and there's Scarlet and Snake Eyes. But for Cobra, there are some identifiable characters, but for the most part, it's just sheer numbers, it's troops. So for the G.I. Joe line, what we decided to do for the Cobra guys is we went back and we, we did the troopers, the Cobra troops. We had three different troops that we had made. Instead of doing more of those types of troops, we thought to ourselves, what other characters can we throw into the mix that'll be able to, to give the collector the opportunity to build an army for Cobra? And with Storm Shadow and Snake Eyes being out, we said, hey, let's go do ninjas, because ninjas are awesome. So we started off with the Red Ninja. This is the Red Cobra Ninja. For this character, we decided to just go all out. Anything we could think of that would belong to a ninja, we put into this character. Um, from his swords, to his throwing stars, uh, to his costume, which is awesome. But not only just the costume cloth bits, but there, we did armor bits for his shins, and for his forearms, and the back of his hands. Uh, he's got all kinds of different ninja weapons, as well as spears, uh, and some really cool hidden ones as well. His helmet, that you see here with the Arishikagi symbol on the front of it actually has three small throwing daggers that are clipped in underneath the brim. His clothing is similar to Storm Shadows, but there's a lot more to it. There's black embroidery, there's the ropes that he uses to hold all his weapons onto his back. There's a black sash that you can also put his throwing stars in. Now, one of the great features of this figure is that there's so many different weapons that he comes with, as well as his, his hat, and he also comes with his mask, a cloth a uh, head wrap that goes around his portrait. So there's all these different ways that you can show the figure. But for the exclusive, we've actually put two heads inside there. One is the regular head, and the second one is an alternative armored portrait. 